So here we go again, a full weekend trip with me thinking and tinkering, and as usual sharing my internal photography thoughts and philosophies with the world. Photography philosophies. I kind of like the sound of that. This time we're taking a trip through Stanley, Idaho, where we explore mountain lakes and mountain streams and eventually a mountain marsh. So the thing with me is I'm always doing things wrong. I know I shouldn't be taking pictures at noon, landscape shots that I know I'll be deleting, but I keep snapping away. Yep, I'll definitely be deleting these in a couple of days. I tried some macro photography this weekend. Unfortunately, nothing really struck my fancy or it would fly off before I even composed the shot. I have to keep reminding myself that this is a lifetime hobby. That's right, I have a lifetime to photograph butterflies. For now, I'll just do some photography of squirrels and watch these deer and... Maybe try photographing the same birds I've photographed a thousand times. Maybe this time I'll get something special. Or not. Long story short, no great photos on day one, so Katie and I decided to spend some time kayaking the beautiful Pettit Lake. Can you blame us? Look at those views. That water was so clear and we had the entire lake to ourselves. Heaven. Day two, I woke up early and took advantage of the morning light. Plus that still water really took it to the next level. I'm certainly no landscape photographer. The fact is you really don't have to be to get pretty images over here. Just look at those mountains. We then spent some time sitting in the woods photographing critters. Sure, I certainly could have photographed these critters about 30 minutes from my house, but... My house doesn't have these views. Or this mountain stream. I think I'll just sit here for a while and listen. I could have sat there for hours, but if we'd stayed a moment longer, we'd have missed out on this cool moment. I'll just let you experience this for yourself. Pretty cool, huh? Ever since moving out west, Katie has been obsessed with aspen groves. We couldn't pass this one up. We had to get out and explore. Something about an aspen grove that really heals the mind. Mm -hmm. 
And yes, Katie and I are definitely tree huggers. Plus this place really makes for some cool images. Here's the part of the trip where Katie indulges me. The part of the trip where I lay on my belly for hours. You know, the point where you start feeling things crawl on you. But you gotta get eye level with those subjects. I even managed to get one of these Wilson's Feralopes, or I don't even know how to pronounce it. Either way, got one flying in. Pretty lucky. We saw a bunch of cool species, like this white-faced ibis and a black tern and an eastern kingbird. Well, at least I think that's what it was. Maybe you can correct me. But it was the yellow-headed blackbirds that really drew me in. Man, I love photographing these guys. We sure do appreciate you guys hanging out with us. We'll see you next time.